My first guests are the co-anchors of Weekend Update on Saturday Night Live, which returns this Saturday with host Chris Rock and musical guest Megan Thee Stallion. Let me introduce, please, Michael Che! Michael Che and Colin Jones. Sit on down, talk to the host. Thank you for being here. Thank you. Yeah! Uh, and he's also a New York Times best-selling author. Please welcome Colin Jost, everybody. Michael Shane and Colin Jost. Sit on down, talk to the moon. From a distance, you will see. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you for being here. This is, this is uh, awesome. fantastic. Yeah, thanks for having us, man. Yeah, this is cool. Yeah, this is nice. Thank you for being my, our first <laughs> two, two uh, person in studio guests, you know? Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Colin, I'm sorry. I just, you, I, I mean, I. I do, you, do, you, do you feel far away? I, I don't feel far away. <laughs> I'm, I am farther away. I'm a lot farther away. Yeah, well, I mean, this is for protocol and all that stuff, so I just, you know, can you... I can't hear anything you're saying. <laughs> I, thank you for coming on the show. I appreciate it. Yeah, anytime, man. <laughs> New normal. Uh, yeah, uh, we're, we're back in 30 Rock. Yeah, man, this is exciting, dude. I think I saw you at the test when we were doing all the uh, no swab real quick the first day. But how's it like working six feet apart from each other? I love it. I owe a lot of people money. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody could get it from me. <laughs> Just enough apart, yeah. It's perfect. Are they making changes to 8H? What's happening on, uh, on Studio 8H? We haven't really been in yet and seen what it is, right? We had, we had our table read. Yeah. What was that like? Uh, well, we have, we have 20 cast members in our show right now, and they have to be six feet apart. So 20 times six is uh, probably like a thousand. I don't yeah, know. yeah, 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 and yeah. Yeah. So you're in a table read, and you're hearing voices, and you're like, who said that? Yeah. You're like, no way. Around. Yeah, it's, it's like a great cool. time for crew to yell stuff, because people will be like, I guess they're just in the cast. It's fine. Get yeah, it feels like you're listening to a podcast. <laughs> you, just, <laughs> like, you don't no, see we're anybody. All here, yeah, yeah it's, it's great. It's kind of cool. It is, but it's you know. Uh, what what will the audience look like? Uh, what are you guys uh, talking about over there? <laughs> <laughs> we're talking about, talking about Saturday Night Live. Oh, that's coming great. back this weekend. That's great. I was like, uh, the, I, what what is the audience going to be like? White. No, no. You <laughs> No, 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 no. Historically, they're all white. No, no. I don't know if you're, no, 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 no. Know if you're a and, fan. No. <laughs> Everyone enjoys that joke. But I mean, uh, is, is it going to change the, the, the style for update, or are you going to still do it the way you guys are, have been doing Well, you've got to be safe. It's a maximum capacity of one at the desk. <laughs> oh, congratulations, Colin. Yeah. yeah, we get nothing with Colin Jost. Sorry. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm all for it. <laughs> as long as I get paid the same, it's fine with me. No, it's, it should be fun. I, I, think it's, I think it's actually more fun. Like, rules make comedy fun. When you, there's things you can't do and there's kind of loopholes, that's when you start to really get creative. And I think the show is kind of the perfect place for that. Yeah. That was like the political answer. No, that was a great answer. I agree with you. I, I love uh, I love rules. And I should watch. <laughs> I love rules. I do. I love it. I go, because I like to break them. I go, yeah, go ahead. Tell me what I can't do. I'll find a way around something. Yeah. Uh, you have the best host for, for uh, the first show back, and it is Chris Rock. Yeah. Uh, and I heard, we had Chris on the show, and he told me that you guys had to actually go to his house and convince him. Oh, yeah. I, we literally went to Chris Rock's house to tell him to do SNL and it was very scary. It felt like that scene in The Godfather. Remember when uh, Tom Hagen goes to tell a guy to put the dude in the movie? Yeah. I've never seen The Godfather, but someone told me it was similar. <laughs> <laughs> I might have got bad information, Jim. No. But I <laughs> Tom Hagen, that's a deep cut. That's a good... Oh, yeah, but that's what it felt like. I'm like, literally, like, how could you not? You got to do it, man. It's New York City. We're back. It's 30 Rock. You got to come home and we got to make people, uh, you know, feel good again. Yeah. Uh, the country wants us. The country yeah. needs us. Yeah. I will be watching. I cannot wait. More with Michael Che and Colin Jones when we come back.